I'm excited to introduce to you Andy Anderson from Charleston, Illinois. Thank you for coming, Andy. Glad to be here. Thank you. I'm excited because... I have no idea what's going to happen during this interview. I don't either. Andy's a magician, uh, the consummate performer, and uh, he's got a red box, and that's all I know. So this is going to be a lot of fun. Thank you for coming. Glad to be here. Yeah. So tell me, first of all, before we get into the, the magic and the mm -hmm. illusions, what, what got you started in magic? Well, in, when I was in fourth grade, I had a teacher, a substitute teacher came in, and she said, that as we did well on a particular subject, she chose a magic trick. Well, that was exciting to me. So I thought, that'd be great. And I never got to see any magic tricks. But it was fun anyway. <laughs> so I got interested at that point and then started reading about Houdini and started doing escape, rope escapes and things of that nature. And mm. Got a book on spooky magic when I was in fifth grade and started doing, just playing around with it, basically. Sure. Awesome. So have you pretty much kept doing magic all through your childhood? No, and your no childhood, I quit. Or? I just got into music. Oh, and okay. was doing music for years, and that was my great interest at that time. And I did, um, was in a gospel rock band, and that, during that time, some of the times that we did our ministry, I'd use a little bit of magic to demonstrate things, ah. as I do now. So that was the, the basic work I did then. Mm -hmm. But then uh, when I got too old for rock and roll... <laughs> Are you I ever said, too old for <laughs> rock and roll? <laughs> uh, yes, you are. Yes, what you age are. is that, by the way? I, mean, That's, I don't know, but it happened. <laughs> <laughs> and so then I started doing, uh, getting back into magic. I did a, did a birthday party for a friend of ours. Their little son had a, wanted to have a birthday party. So I said, sure, I'll put something together. And I did that. And one of the parents said, say, could you do it for my, my child? And it began snowballing. And people started saying, yeah, we'll even pay you to do it. And so I thought, wow, hey, yeah. I'll do that. Bonus. So, so it's been like that. That was 1991 that I started doing that. And then okay. started uh, doing it professionally at around 95, 96. I started marketing a little bit. And, I see. It. Well, see, I got to see Andy perform. Um, I was out at Lincoln Log Cabin. This has been mm. several summers ago, but you, you did a great old-time magician's act. And yes. my son and I both, we were enthralled. In fact, you, my son was one of the boys you had come up and kind of help him. So he has a great memory of that. And I've got pictures of you, actually, I doing see. some of your I magic. <laughs> so it's kind of fun to have, yeah, to have <laughs> it all come back around and I get to talk to you. So what is your favorite type of um, illusion to do? Comedy. I'm d mm. I'm an entertainer, so I like to use the magic as a prop, basically, and mm -hmm. just entertain people. I love to make people smile and laugh and have a good time. That's we we don't have enough of the family entertainment like that anymore. That's right. So I enjoy doing it that way. Good and wholesome and fun. exactly right. Awesome. And I do close up, and I do I don't really do a lot of large illusions. I did some, but mm -hmm. uh, I lost some things in a garage fire oh, wow. and rebuilt up from there. But mainly, what I do is. Uh, Smaller props, mm -hmm. shows that I can do in people's homes. I do festivals and fairs and things of that nature. I'm dying to know what's in the red box. I brought a gift for you. <laughs> a gift? A gift, yeah. All right. Inside this simple gift box <laughs> is the secret to all my magic. It's okay. the <laughs> amazing lemon. Well, that doesn't the, look scary at all. Well, no, it's just a, you can touch it there. See, it's a, just a simple lemon. It looks like a simple lemon. You know, lemons give it a bad rap because people say they buy a bad car or they get... I got a lemon. Lemons are great because they're, they're antibacterial, the juice is. Okay. And they're great in your water to, to, to liven up a drink. So true. But these lemons, this particular lemon is an amazing lemon. What and makes it amazing? Would you like to see that? I would. I'm glad you asked. Because, <laughs> now this isn't a card trick. Okay. But I use these cards in this case, it's going to be used for a mind experiment, if you don't mind. Okay. So we're going to use your mind. <laughs> I like people to do the trick myself. I don't like, I like for them to see that they have these qualities that are magical. I'm so, gonna bring out my magical side, huh? Right. All right. So like I say, these are just props that I use here. Now I'd like for you to clear your mind, Jessica. That's don't, not hard. Just, <laughs> <laughs> you're doing it rather well. Just <laughs> just don't think of it. It is, actually it is difficult to clear your mind. Just, okay. just let your mind go blank. I have the two of hearts I always keep on the cards, the top of these cards, because I wanna write something on the two of the parts here. But just let your mind be a blank mm -hmm. slate. Just. As if you know how we get when we start reading a tax form or something, just like that. Yes. You know, you can, I can't read your mind. Nobody can do that. But I can allow things to be inserted into your mind if, it, if you allow that. Okay. You know, you know, there are times I can look at my, my beautiful wife's eyes and I can tell. She doesn't even have to say a word and I know she wants me to pick the socks up off the floor. <laughs> it's just, it's things like that. This is the same kind of thing. So just clear your mind. Okay. Pretty clear. And when I get the point where... Okay, now if you could do this, pick the, <laughs> pick the lemon up. Yes. Put it on your forehead. I can do that. Okay. All right. Just a second. 
Go <laughs> get this. I have a sneaking oh. feeling that this yeah. isn't really part of the trick. You're just making. Me no, no. <laughs> this is this is the amazing lemon. This is most important. Okay. Okay. Now, while that, you can put that down now. Okay. While that's drying, I'm just going to show you some cards here. All right. And I want you to look, focus on any one of those cards. You can see you have a choice there. Just okay. focus on one. When you say focus. when you see that one, you're focusing on. Say, I see it. I see it. Okay. Now you can change your mind. You sure that's the one you want? Yes, I'm sure. Okay. <laughs> Tell everyone here now what card it is. It doesn't matter if I hear. You'll see why. Okay. It's the Ace of Clubs. The Ace of Clubs. Why the Ace of Clubs? Anything special about the Ace of Clubs at all? No. It was just the most hidden card there. Well, it is. The <laughs> <laughs> That's the card I wanted you to choose was the Ace of Clubs. Oh, you're kidding so, me. So if, uh, now here's the next, next part. Take the amazing orange. Or amazing. Amazing lemon. lemon. I use the orange sometimes too. <laughs> On the Ace of Clubs. We have written on the two of hearts. I'm going to mm -hmm. turn it over like that. Tap the top with, with the amazing lemon. Right. And you see what happens is that the ace of clubs comes right at the top off of the two of hearts. Just like that. Oh, my goodness. And that's, that's done with the amazing <laughs> lemon. That's that simple. So. Wow. There you are. That is amazing, Andy. You're right. Thank you. Is that fun, though? That was a lot see, of fun. See, the main fun. thing I'm is it's right fun. Here and I, yes, it's totally fun. <laughs> yeah. I love that. Now, would you like to do something else? Mm -hmm. Or do you want to Make see? lemonade? We can do that, yes. <laughs> Very gentle now. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I need to borrow a dollar bill. If someone has a dollar oh, bill, yep, yep, yep. And so Let me check. as you can see, I bring some just in case somebody doesn't uh, have any. I know I have some. I had lunch earlier. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. Now, how long have you had this dollar bill? Um, short time. A short time. Is it very special to you at all? Not really. It isn't. Well, uh, what I want you to do is to, to keep track of this. Okay. I want you to take that part of it right there. Okay. We're going to fold this up right here. Starting to have second thought. <laughs> oh, it's fine. It's fine. We're just going to fold that up into a nice little pack because I want to show you something that's uh, a little demonstration here. Okay. That people aren't aware of. If we smash this into a little packet. Okay. People aren't aware. Now I can tear this very easy, as you can see. Mm -hmm. But if we have it into a little packet like this, it's very difficult to tear. In fact, it's very difficult to do something else. If you'll take that little. Uh, that's not a thimble. <laughs> <laughs> take the cover off there. Okay. All right. It's also impossible when a bill's folded up like that. He's burning my money. To burn it. <laughs> In fact, it's impossible to light a match. As you can see, it doesn't burn. Uh, <laughs> right. Okay. Well, <laughs> um, <clears throat> so that's the end of this one. Well, sometimes that happens. Oh, you know what we didn't do? We didn't use the amazing lemon here. That's We should have rubbed it with the amazing lemon. Oh. Otherwise, and see... Should Otherwise, we stop tape and redo it? no, that's okay. that's <laughs> it's like gone, gone. Wait, 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 wait. You know, nothing can be created or destroyed, okay? Right, everything is still existence, even if it burns up, the molecules are still there in the atmosphere that's somewhere. So, true. so, if you'll take the amazing lemon, okay. just hold it over a few of the fumes that are coming out of there. Now, that can not only pick up those molecules, it can also clone those molecules. Now, if you'll take the knife, this is not an amazing <laughs> knife, this is a knife out of my <laughs> wife's kitchen drawer, which I hope she doesn't find out about, okay. And just cut it open around the perimeter of the orange or the the lemon. I know I'm supposed to cut away from me, but yeah, I never really that's okay. Listen to my mother when she says. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Just tear it open there, if you would, okay. please. We are making lemonade. Oh my yes. goodness! Ah! See, this is delicious juice. Oh, there's something in there too. You probably want to take that out of there <laughs> and unroll it. You didn't know you get oh, lemon juice goodness. all over your hands, did you? No, I didn't. Yeah. Okay, I'm unrolling it. Okay. It and good. if you look at it closely, the molecules have gone back completely <gasps> together, well, except for the piece that was torn out, which should match right there. <clears throat> In fact, to make even certain, the, do the uh, serial numbers line up there? Yes. Okay. They so, totally line ladies up. Ladies and gentlemen, the amazing lemon. The amazing lemon with the amazing so. Andy. <laughs> that is incredible. Oh, this is so much fun. Great. And not only that, but you get to keep your dollar. Wow. And the amazing lemon. But <laughs> yeah, I, get I, was to, say, I get the thimble back. I get to make lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> that is so much fun, Andy. Yeah. Thank you. You're I don't know welcome. how you did that. Now, if, you want no a, if you want another dollar that's not ripped, that's okay, but you can. That's quite all right. It was there. totally worth the dollar. Great. Yeah. <laughs> it was for me, too. That is fun. Well, what's your most um, enjoyable trick? That you know, you always actually, like to watch. I enjoy this. I like to watch. Yeah. I like to watch uh, Lance Burton. 
and his doves. I use do some dove work in, in my shows. Okay. And but he's a master, Lance Burton. Mm -hmm. Some people don't even know the guys who is, but uh, yeah, I've heard I've heard of him. I think yeah. I may have seen him once or twice on. And Dwayne Laughlin. Dwayne Laughlin. And uh, Andy Dallas, who owns Dallas and Company in Champaign. He uh, actually has been my mentor for years. Oh, Got, okay. And taught me a lot of the things that I do, and I still uh, we have club meetings every uh, month, which I haven't been to for quite a while. But <laughs> <laughs> Well, this is a really great trick, and I bet I bet the faces. I can see kids, especially, really getting into. Oh yeah, kids love it. But you know what's neat is that whenever I say, "Do you would you like to see some magic?" and the adults say, "Oh yes, my little son here would like to watch." <laughs> but the kids trying to watch because the parents are going, "Let's see that." Yes. So it's it's the sure. it's the parents who use their kids for that excuse, don't we all? <laughs> yes, well. absolutely. Well, I wish we had tons more time to see more tricks, but we are That's out funny. of time, and this was so much fun. Maybe we'll just have to have you back again. Oh, I'd be glad to do it. Well. Thank you very much for coming and sharing your hobby with us, My Andy. My pleasure. Thank you very mm -hmm. much. Blessings to you.